girlfriend reactions to Hugh Hefner's death. Hugh Hefner, the founder of Playboy magazine and a notorious Playboy himself, died September 27, 2017 at his Playboy mansion. Head not only changed the way audiences view sex and sexuality, he was also famously linked to many girlfriends and playmates who are now publicly mourning his death at age 91. Let's take a look at some of the ladies in his life. Shannon Tween Simmons M. 1982, Falcon Crest 1981-90 Actress Shannon Tween was Playmate of the Year and she was also briefly Hefner's girlfriend. Hefner told people that same year, once Shannon and I met, things happened fairly quickly. It's a good lesson in never underestimating the power of a woman. Despite the whirlwind romance, Tweet was meant for another. In 1983 she began dating Kiss Rucker Gene Simmons marrying him in 2011 but she kept a soft spot for Head. As news broke about his passing, she posted the photo of a young Hefner to Instagram with the caption, Rip my friend. You changed the world. Hours later, she posted a second photo of Hefner, Simmons, and herself with the caption, Number sign Hugh Fender will be missed by us both and many more around the world. He had a profound effect on my life. My husband and head often talk about the many things they had in common aside from me. Movies, comics, politics, philosophies and love. Isabella Street. James. In 2002, Isabella Street. James was invited to become one of Hefner's girlfriends reportedly one of seven at the time. She left the mansion in 2004 and later said in her book, Honey Tales, behind closed doors at the Playboy Mansion, that while she felt out of water after leaving, she didn't miss it. The book was not always kind about her time at the mansion, but Street. James did speak fondly of Hefner after his death. She posted a photo on Instagram of the two of them, saying, Heg, I have no words. Although I wrote a book about the two years I lived at the Playboy Mansion with Head, I just don't have the words right now. I will find the words tomorrow. Right now just airs. Rest in peace Hugh Marston Hefner. Number sign R.I.P.H.E.F. Number sign Hugh Hefner. Kendra Wilkinson. In 2004, Kendra Wilkinson became one of Hefner's girlfriends after appearing as a painted girl at his 78th birthday party and in 2005 she was one of the three girlfriends featured on the television show The Girls Next Door 2005 to 10. She eventually concluded her time with Hef after meeting her now husband, former football pro Hank Basket, and moving out to be with him and start her own show, Kendra 2009 to 11. Wilkinson and Head remained close, and she attributes her continued success to her Playboy experience. In a statement to Entertainment Tonight, she said, Head changed my life. I couldn't be more thankful for our friendship and our time together. She posted on Twitter, Thank you for all of your thoughts and condolences guys, followed by a second post saying, Can't really put into words how I really feel. It's easy to say he will be missed and how much I loved him. There's a lot more than that. The two posts were followed by a photo of Wilkinson and Hefner on her wedding day. She married Basket at the Playboy Mansion. Bridget Marquardt Bridget Marquardt was another of Head's girlfriends featured on The Girls Next Door. Like Wilkinson, Marquardt found new love in 2008 and left the mansion. While she reportedly lost touch with Hefner over the years, his death still had an impact. Marquardt posted a photo of herself with Hefner on Instagram with the caption, So sad but forever grateful for all the wonderful memories and amazing experiences number sign reflect number sign playboy. The Shannon Twins Twins Carissa and Christina Shannon joined the girls next door in 2009 as part of a new batch of girlfriends alongside Crystal Harris. The twins, who were Miss July and August 2009 and Head's last girlfriends prior to his engagement to Harris, told the blast that they've been inconsolable since learning of his death. Our faces are swollen from crying, they said. The twins also noted that Hitner had discussed death with them before, insisting, there's no heaven without sex. They said Hef wasn't afraid to die. He was everything to us, the twins said. No matter what happened in our lives he was always number one and always at our back. Our love we shared was unconditional something many don't get to experience in life. He helped us understand who we were. We had enough memories and fun to last forever. It isn't just Hefner's girlfriends who have been outspoken since his death. Continue reading to see what former playmates have said about the media mogul.
Anna DeRico. Shortly after appearing as Playboy's Playmate of the Month in September 1995, Anna DeRico was cast in a starring role on Baywatch 1989-2001. DeRico took to Twitter following Hefner's death, crediting him for her big break. Hugh Hefner put me in Playboy and ignited my career. I am forever indebted, Head. You will forever live on as an icon of epic proportions. Number sign Rip. Pamela Anderson. D. Erko as fellow Baywatch star and 14-time Playboy cover model Pamela Anderson is arguably the most famous playmate of them all. In an emotional video posted to Instagram, a visibly tearful Anderson said, Goodbye, Head. While the video message was short, Anderson's much longer caption provided insight into their relationship and Hefner's final months. Mr. Hefner I have so many thoughts, she said. You taught me everything important about freedom and respect. Outside of my family you were the most important person in my life. You gave me my life. People tell me all the time that I was your favorite. I am in such deep shock. Anderson went on to describe Hefner's health, but you were old. Your back hurt you so much. Last time I saw you you were using the walker. You didn't want me to see. You couldn't hear. You had a piece of paper in your pocket you showed me with my name Pamela with a heart around it. Now, I'm falling apart. This feeling is so crazy. She continued, it's raining in Paris now. I'm by the window. Everything anyone loves about me is because you understood me. Accepted me and encouraged me to be myself. Love like no one else. Live recklessly with unfiltered abandon. You said the magazine was about a girl like me. That I embody the spirit you fantasized about. I was the one. You said. I can't hear you say be brave. There are no rules. Live your life I'm proud of you. There are no mistakes. And with men enjoy. Your wonderful laugh you have the world by the tail you are a good girl and you are so loved you are not crazy. You are wild and free see strong stay vulnerable. It's movie time. You loved my boys. You were always, always there for us. With your love your crazy wisdom. She finished her caption with, I will miss your everything. Thank you for making the world a better place. A freer and sexier place. You were a gentleman charming, elegant, chivalrous and so much fun. Goodbye head, your Pamela. Jenny McCarthy. Jenny McCarthy got her Playboy star as Miss October 1993 followed by holding the title of Playmate of the Year for 1994. She then went on to host MTV's Singled Out 1995 to 97 guest star on several sitcoms, and host her own talk show. McCarthy, like many other Playmates, attributes at least some of her success to the magazine. Following the Hefner's death, she posted a photo of one of her Playboy covers on Twitter with the caption, Rip number sign head thank you for being the revolutionary and changing so many people's lives especially mine. I hope I made you proud. Number sign PM Joey 94. Garment Electra. Garment Electra is another celebrity whose fame was bolstered by Playboy. She appeared on the cover three times, and her first pictorial in 1996 helped put her in the spotlight. After learning of Hefner's death, she posted the photo with him on Instagram. In her caption she wrote, Are you? I? P. Hugh Hefner followed by a touching tribute. The American icon who in 1953 introduced the world to Playboy Mag and built the company into one of the most recognizable American global brands in history. I am so grateful I had the opportunity to shoot many Playboy celebrity pictorials with you. Head thank you for picking me and bringing me into the magical world of Playboy. Electra added, I just can't stop crying and I can't imagine how many bunnies are crying for you too. You are a class act and I will always have gratitude for your kindness. Love you. Heg. Abrian Curry. Model and actress Abrian Curry won the first cycle of America's Next Top Model in 2003 and went on to appear in Playboy for the first time in 2006. She returned to model for a second time in 2008 and made Playboy's 2008 Top 25 Sexiest Women. Upon hearing about Hefner's death, Curry posted on Twitter, I just found out that Hugh Hefner died. Thank you for the time together, two covers and artistic freedom on my second shoot. You believed in my vision. Amber Campisi. Amber Campisi was a 2005 Playboy Playmate of the Month as well as occasional guest on The Girls Next Door and later the roommate of Kendra Wilkins and on Kendra. Now part of her family's restaurant business, Campisi shared her sadness upon hearing of Hefner's death. 
she posted on Twitter. Heartbroken love you have I will always cherish the fun times and am proud to be a part of the number sign Playboy family. RIP. Paris Hilton. Paris Hilton, perhaps best known for her sex tape scandal and reality television show The Simple Life 2003-07 posed for Playboy in 2005. Hilton took to Twitter to honor Hefner, sharing her Playboy cover and writing, Love you Heg. She also posted a series of photos alongside Hefner on Instagram including a shot of Hilton in a bunny costume, in leopard print lingerie, and dressed as Alice from Alice in Wonderland. In her caption she wrote, So sad to hear the news about Ephi Fethner. He was a number sign legend, innovator, genius, one of a kind with a heart of gold. We had so many fun and incredible memories together. I will miss him dearly. Rest in peace my friend. Kim caught a giant. Social media wasn't the only place that Hilton honored Hefner. As Kim Kardashian shared on Twitter, she and Hilton were also exchanging text messages about his death. Paris and I are reminiscing about the Playboy parties at the mansion and how much we love head, she wrote, adding that Hilton was sending her the perfect head emojis of a man surrounded on either side by women in money ears. Kardashian, who posed for Playboy in December 2007, posted her own tribute to Hefner on Twitter, ripped to the legendary Hugh Hefner. I'm so honored to have been a part of the Playboy team. You will be greatly missed. Love you Heg. Ekoxo. Kaylerid. Kaylerid, who recently welcomed a son with Olympic swimmer Ryan Lochte, was Playboy's Miss July in 2015. Reed posted a photo of herself in a red Playboy bunny outfit and began her caption with a quote from Hefner, It's good to be selfish. But not so self-centered that you never listen to other people. She continued the caption with her own words writing, deeply saddened by this news. My prayers and thoughts are with the Hefner family number sign Rifef. I have met so many amazing people and friends throughout my at Playboy family. Thank you Head for all that you have done for so many people in your life. You will be greatly missed. You're an icon and will light forever in our hearts. Naomi Campbell Naomi Campbell has been on so many magazine covers, it's easy to forget that Playboy was among them back in 1999. Given all the hoopla about Y2K, Campbell could very well have been the last person ever to grace the magazine. Upon learning of his passing, Campbell shared the photo of Hefner on Twitter and wrote, Number sign art. I. Pete number sign Hufa Fender at Hufa Fender you were a number sign force and movement cultural creator. She also shared a second post with photos of her iconic cover, which was syndicated in Playboy magazines all over the world. Trisha Helfer. While Trisha Helfer got her start modeling, when she posed for the cover of Playboy back in 2007 she was most widely known for her role as Salon No. 6 in the television series Battlestar Galactica. Helfer recalled this time in her life by sharing the photo of her Playboy cover to Instagram upon learning of Hefner's death. In her caption she wrote, Had the pleasure of shooting the 2007 cover story for Playboy with Aunt Sandora's Yoga official with Hugh Hefner. Denise Richards in December 2004, just a few months before she filed for divorce from Charlie Sheen, Denise Richards posed for the cover of Playboy. Just after Hefner's death, she shared this cover on Instagram along with her condolences for Hefner's family. She wrote, Hugh Hefner you will be missed. So honored to be part of Playboy. An icon and your legacy will light on. My thoughts are with your family and loved ones. Was that Alia Banks? Rapper Azette Aliyah Banks is no stranger to controversy, so it only makes sense that she was on the cover of the controversial though iconic Playboy magazine in 2015. Her cover marked the first for the publication, which she acknowledged in her Instagram tribute to Heathner, featuring the photo of the cover. Banks said, It was an absolute honor to be chosen as the first female rapper to make the cover of Playboy magazine. May your legacy live on. Rest in peace, number sign Hugh Fethner.